Hello and welcome to the Red Envelope Guide for a Sleeping Dog Definitive Edition. In this game, it came with all the DLC from the 360, which include the Red Envelope DLC. What that DLC did was put 20 red envelopes around the city to find, and each envelope has $50,000 in it, so you can walk away with a cool million if you find all 20. Now in the 360 version, it was very easy to find. They were all next to the parking garages. In the Definitive, ed definitive Edition, they mixed it up and put them all over the place. So I'm going to show you what I think is the easiest way to collect them all and where they are. So if we look on the map, we are right here at, at Yao Ling Court, right next to Dun Lao Alley. Now we start here because we have to get the first red envelope in style. So you just take your bike. You should have enough of a buildup right from the end of the alley. If you don't, you can back up further. And it is right over here. So you make the jump across the highway, get off your bike, and it is sitting on this TV. There we go. Okay, and here's the next one. It's at this, we'll start at this parking garage here. Uh, parking lot here. It's right next to the undercover offices and it's a long ways away from here but this one there's not really an easy way to it but if you start here oh, get out of the way really you're a worse driver than I am and we follow this dumbass down here uh, we have to go into the tunnels so we go here cross over there we go now, it's pretty far down this way, but like I said, there's not really anything closer that I could think of or that I could find as a marker. And just showing you where it is on the map isn't going to be very helpful, and you'll see why in a minute, but it is right here. So if we look at the map, you start here. Go down there, turn around, come up this way, and it's right at where this little gray part is. Uh, now, unfortunately, like I said, that's a very long ways away. Now, this warehouse is right here on the map. Uh, the undercover offices are over here, and this is the warehouse. Now, you want to go down to the, uh, the southeast end of it. And at the southeast end, there's a bunch of crates. Stop here, take off the helmet, and you just climb these like Spider-Man. There we go. And the red envelope is right there at the end of the boxes. We are starting at this parking lot. It is just southwest of the waterfront. And if we just go over here towards the waterfront. And we go over here, you will see it sitting on top of that pipe. Now you can't climb the pipes, uh, but if you just jump over here, you also can't fall between them. So, boom, another 50,000. All right, so here we are. We are over in the night market now. We are at the Northeast Clothing Store, which is this guy here. And if you haven't done the mission for her yet, there's that lady there who wants a favor. So to get this one, we go in behind here. Excuse me. We go left up these stairs, climb the scaffolding. And if we take a left, it is right there at the end, hiding up here. Right, and we are still in the night market. We're actually just a little ways off. This is where we started the last one. So we need over here, just to the north in the center of it. Uh, there's a few electronic stands here and this guy wanting to sell you food. If we go in behind his food stall and up the stairs, go through these doors. And if you look in here, this is actually where you started the game after you came out of prison, it's where you had your first bite. Then we go up here, Oops, take a right, not a left. Up here and over in this incense container outside the store is another red envelope, another 50 grand. Okay, so this next one is probably the easiest one to find. If we look on the map here, here's the massage parlor and here's your apartment. 
So all you have to do is go to the massage parlor and it's sitting in the doorway. It's the easiest one to find. You know what, 50,000, you know, get yourself a nice massage while you're here. Okay, so here we are at the temple. Uh, this one took me longer to find than it probably should have, but you take a left there as soon as you come in, go into this dirt path, and as soon as you're allowed to, oh, there we go, go off road, up the hill, and it's right underneath the tree. Boop, another 50 grand. Okay, so this next one, if we look here, here we are at Lok Fu Park. And if you just go right to where it says it on the corner, you will find that there's a bus in the way. There's one section over there, which is part of the police investigation for Popstar, I believe. And then if we turn around and come this way, on the other side of the street is this red envelope chilling in the park with that guy doing Tai Chi. All right, and the next one is at Top Glamour Imports Limited. Uh, it's this giant area right above there's the waterfront, there's a car dealer, and if you haven't done it yet, there's the Cheaters Never Prosper Favor. Uh, but we're gonna go in here. Safety first, always wear your helmet on a motorcycle. We're a badass, we're not an idiot. And if you go in here, now this one's a little weird. Gotta take the jump. If you don't, you won't be able to get the envelope. You gotta look cool. Anyway, so we stop here at these boxes, climb up here, climb up here, and you can see it over there, but you can't, this is the easiest way I found to get to it, and then you just take a leap and land right on it. All right, and we are now out of North Point. We are now moving into Central, and the first one in Central will be at the boardwalk here. There will be a couple bad guys there, but if you get off the ramp, here I'll bring up the map again. Right where I am here is the fastest way down. You can actually see the envelope off in the distance. Uh, you come down here. Park nicely. And jump off. And now we've got to swim all the way out to this boat. And up here on the prow of the boat. All right, and the next one, still in Central, is right here is where we'll start. We're in this alleyway. We're to the right of the Sui Shan Alley and just south of the easternmost parking lot. Uh, so we're going to, uh, we'll just run it. It's not too far. So we'll run in here, and it's at the end of this alley. And along the way, You'll know if you're in the right one because you have to jump over, I want to say, three gates and then those three guys will be there looking like a badass for whatever reason, just standing in this random alley. And we jump over gate one, up the stairs, up the stairs, jump over gate two, hang a left, hello, keep going, one more gate. Oh yeah, stretch it out, guy. Must have been a hard day. And up here, we break into these people's house, and over in the corner here, they have $50,000 for us. Alright, so here we are. We are at this point at the map. Just look for the big U building in the business district. And it is in the, or on, I guess, the reception desk. So we just run in here, past all the businessmen and businesswomen. And right there, boosh, another 50 grand. All right, here's the final one in Central, only four of them. Uh, we are at the hospital, and we will go in here and ignore the statue that's on the desk. That'll be in a later video. In here, hospital, or hospital elevators ahead. Go past the nursing station. And past the nursing station, it is the, uh, oops, my bad, it is the first door on the left. As you can see, there's a mob guy, or, well, not necessarily, some old guy, and he has $50,000 in his room. Okay, and now we're moving on to Kennedy Town. There's only 
two envelopes in Kennedy Town, and they do break the uh, smoothness of going around the map a little bit, but there's no way around it. So the first one is over near Wong's, par Wong's parking and this parking lot. Uh, there's the parking lot right there. So if you go to the park across the street from it in the fountain is uh, the red envelope. Another 50 grand. Okay, and now the next one and last one in Kennedy Town is over at the cemetery. I guess somebody forgot their envelope when they went to a funeral. But we go, oops, come on, open the door. You can do it. We go over here. Now we go up the first set of stairs, up the second set of stairs, hang a left. And then you see this fountain here. Get into it, climb up. And up here is another envelope with $50,000 in it. All right, and now for the next one, we are at this small square. It's a parking lot. It is in between Victoria Peak and Aberdeen, which is down here. Uh, this is probably the most out of the way one, and it's considered part of Central, but as you can tell, it's not connected to Central in any way. All right, now the next one, we are now into Aberdeen. Uh, if you've follow, been following along, you take this road out and you end up next to this parking garage here. It is right there. And then underneath the road you just drove down is a little market area. And on the table in the back is our envelope. I guess somebody must have had a really good day at the market and forgot to take their money home with them. All right, so here we are. We are going for the last two. They're both in Aberdeen. They are both in the water. And contrary to what I said before, apparently you can drive boats in this game. So here we are on the map. We are at the island. We are on the docks here. Uh, so hopefully in your game, there will be this boat here because this will come in real handy. So the first envelope, as you can see, is right here. Uh, can I dock here? Is that, no? Okay, well, whatever here up here and up and there's the envelope oh there we go all right so here we are the final one we look on our map we'll see that we're out on this island here so hopefully you manage to get a boat and bring it over here if you don't get a boat you can drive up to the overlook that's here jump in it is, oh, it's on the other side of the island, but then it's not too far to swim, but the envelope is on the west end of the island. It's right here. So if you end up jumping off the overlook, you have to swim around the island. And that is the final red envelope. We are now a million dollars richer, never mind my total in the corner. I may have screwed up and picked one up early and had to restart. But you will have a cool million dollars at this point to go and buy all the clothes, cars, and massages that you want. So thank you for watching. Have a nice day.